Hey everyone, we are here today at Disney's Vero Beach Resort showing you a deluxe studio. This room sleeps up to four people. It has a pull-out couch as well as a queen-size bed. And these studios do not have a view that you can book. You just kind of get whatever they give you when they assign the rooms. However, some of them do have a pretty nice ocean view. We're kind of in one of the partial ocean view rooms, but we're pretty happy with the view we have from the balcony. So we'll show you that when we get in there. Let's check it out. So you can see when we first come in here, we have that queen size bed over there and a little bit of a different layout with the pull out sleeper sofa right here when you first walk in, but it does open up the room quite a bit when the bed is not pulled out. So you've kind of got a little entryway here. Now you've got a window there with some curtains. Once you draw the curtains in here, it does get pretty dark because there's only a few light sources, but during the day, plenty of natural light in here. Really cute picture of some sea turtles up there, which you can often find nesting down on the beach. Now I did take a look at this and could not find a single hidden Mickey. I feel like they missed an opportunity there. So if you want to pause it and take a look, maybe you'll find one, but I didn't see any hidden Mickeys in there, even though they had the chance. Now on the nightstand here in between the two beds, we do have a couple USB outlets and wall outlets built in there. So those have been updated. And we also have a couple more of those USB outlets in the dresser over here. So you got a few drawers and a Blu-ray player, and then some more of those USB outlets as well as the TV mounted on the wall. We've got a small little table and chairs over there in the corner. Of course, the door that connects to the one bedroom villa next door, making this a two bedroom lock off. Got kind of a pretty picture of a pier there on the wall and then the bed does not have under the bed storage looks like it's kind of raised up and it might have it but there is a block under there so no under the bed storage here we do have the queen size bed with a couple lights over the headboard also there is a ceiling fan in this room which is kind of nice uh, have a little bit of airflow in here without having the air conditioning running now going over to the bathroom area you've got a closet on the left hand side that's where you're going to find your safe and your luggage rack, extra pillow and blankets, iron and ironing board, all that good stuff here in the closet. And on the other side, we have our kitchenette. So there is a mini fridge down below. And this mini fridge does have no little freezer section in it. So worth pointing out, there's no freezer in the studio mini fridge but we have a full size coffee pot and of course coffee and cups and things like that. Some paper towels and a microwave. And then the cabinet is also stocked with a toaster and lots of paper plates and plastic ware. And then we have the door over here that closes off to the bathroom. Got the full length mirror mounted on the door. We've got a pretty good sized vanity here in the corner. Lots of little storage drawers and things underneath. Of course, you've got your sink there and the mirror above that. And then a little storage unit on the wall where they kind of made a hidden Mickey. I'm gonna call that a hidden Mickey. It wasn't, you know, in the art or anything, but it is here in the room right there above the toilet. And then you have your tub and shower right here. And they do have the refillable soap and shampoo and conditioner. They're mounted to the wall. And then your towel rods are just kind of hiding behind the door there. And we'll head out and show you the awesome view we have. As we mentioned before, you cannot choose your view, but some of the rooms do have a pretty good view from their balcony. You can see the balconies are actually a decent size. We've got a couple chairs and a little table out here. Middle of the day, the sun's kind of hot right here, but once it starts to go down, we're gonna have some shade. And this particular room, we've got a nice view of the ocean if you go over to this side. We've got a couple cottages here. We're kind of on the edge of the Vero Beach Resort property, but you can see the Atlantic Ocean over there, so really pretty sounds amazing you hear the waves crashing and the wind blowing and really pretty and love kind of sitting out here so we'll definitely enjoy sitting out here for a few minutes while we stay here and now back in the room just really quickly wanted to show you this pull out sleeper sofa with the bed pulled out as you can see there's still plenty of room 
in the room uh, not a ton of space taken up to pull that out because it is a double or a full-size bed it is not a queen size so it doesn't take up quite as much room so when you got that pulled out it's just a little bit tighter over here by the door and that is going to conclude this tour of the deluxe studio here at Disney's Vero Beach Resort we hope you enjoyed that room tour. If you did, please give us a thumbs up below and comment with any questions you have about this resort. And of course, subscribe so you know when we have more of these resort tours coming on our channel. And if you'd like to see a tour of the entire resort here at Vero Beach, we've got that linked over here for you as well as down in the description below. Be sure to check that out. Thank you so much for watching and until next time. We're here with the ears.